Hey everybody, this is Ebony and welcome back to my channel, Everything Eb. If you are subscribed to my channel, thank you so much for your support. If you're not yet subscribed, what are you waiting for? Go ahead and hit the subscribe button. Um, this is part two to November paycheck number two or week number two. I can't keep up with the paychecks, but anyway, um, this is our savings challenges. So if you would like to see what I'm doing, go ahead and keep watching. Let's just get into it. The money's already there because I just did my cash envelopes and sinking funds. And again, let's just hop into the savings challenges. So I never really know where I want to start. This $2 is from my uh, wallet, which you all know goes into month ahead. So because month ahead is a savings challenge, I do that in this video. And, uh, yeah, let's just get to it. What is first? Hmm. Let's see what we did first. The cards challenge. Let's just go ahead and get into that. <clears throat> we did, we pulled $76 this week. You all know this is going towards our cruise. So, this week we pulled... remember the joker because that's i made that into a joker because this deck didn't have any jokers so jokers are 30 then we did an ace which is 16 hopefully you guys can see that then we did two tens a four and two threes so that was a total of 76 dollars and let's just go ahead and color it in first and then we'll stuff it let's just do this um I don't know what color I want to do. I don't know, child. Let's just do this blue highlighter. So anyway, the other Joker. The Ace of Heart, which is the last Ace. Okay, we getting somewhere with some of the decent ones. But look, we have all the Queens, two of the Kings. So, this is a 10 of club. We'll color that. A 10 of diamonds. So, all the 10s are gone as well. Four of club. Three of club and three of diamonds. So, that's it. We color those in. So, let's get our $76. So, 50, 70, 75, and 76. And that is in the short-term and savings challenge binder. So, let's just get to it. I'm apologizing now for the shaking. I'm using a different tripod. I'm trying my best not to shake, but I don't know if it is because I cannot see the camera from where I am. So, this savings challenge is for our cruise which is due at the end of the month. So let's see what we have when we put this money in here. So the deck of cards challenge is 50, 100, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 75, 80, 85, 93. 95, 3, 5, 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28. And I'm going to count that over because I don't know if that's really 328 or not. So let's just count it over. 51, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 3. 5, 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28. Yeah, okay. So 328, and we need to have 500 by the end of the month. So we're going to pull some more cards today, guys. So the ones I did, I always just put off to the side. And I will do that later. Oh, I'll put them where I put the rest of them later because i'll keep this deck of cards because i'll definitely do this one again so let's shuffle the cards that we have left and you all know the upcoming week is only my one part-time paycheck so i don't know how many i'm gonna pull but we'll definitely have it done by the end of the month so feeling good so let's see what we got guys 
Hey, hold on. I just want to make sure that this is still recording. Oh, and it is. Okay. All right. Okay. So we pull, finally oh, we pulled a king. That's 15. 22. 37. 44. 57. Should I leave it at 57? Yeah, I'm going to leave it at 57. Ooh. Yeah, let's just leave it at 57 because, like I said, that is a um, my part-time paycheck. I want to do too much. So, this is what we're put, we are doing next week, guys. $57. I'm excited. So, we'll put that one off to the side. I must have left these from last time, so... Let's just move them. And let's get into the next one. The next one we are doing is... Let's just do the 100 envelope challenge. Oh, you know what? Let's do the zero out. So the zero out again was $13 this week. One of my paychecks was 7 and one of them was 6 So you all know the zero out challenge goes to debt... So, um, we'll put the $13 off to the side because debt is also one of my savings challenges. So, this $13 goes to debt. This $2 is to month ahead. So, we'll sit them both off to the side right there for when we get to them. So, 100 envelope challenge, which I made myself. This week, we're doing number six and seven. I just so happen to be going in order because I'm starting small because I really should have waited. So, six and seven is what we're stuffing today. So five and six. Again, I'm not really in a rush to do this. I want to do some of the larger numbers, but it will not be right now. I'm really focusing on Christmas. I'm trying to anyway. And then seven. I just wanted to get it started. I just could not wait. Like I said, I may start another savings challenge today because there's a few envelopes. I need to do one for my passport now that i had to spend that money on something but anyway six and seven now complete and we will color those in a different color let's get the color pencils mm, let's go with blue since it's the first one that popped out and again because these color pencils oh i now i know this shaking i'm sorry y'all i don't know what to do to stop it this different tripod today is just not as sturdy but i think i like the angle so i don't know what i'm gonna do so anyway that's six and seven today for the hundred envelope challenge i'd be glad when i could knock some of these ones off at the bottom Ooh. but anyway that's it for this time i don't know what we'll do next time i just have to see what my budget looking like so next I forgot I was going to start this one and I don't remember what it was for. So let's just go ahead. I remember I was going to take $5 out of my spending money to get this one started. It saves a total of $100. I literally don't remember what I was going to do with it, but I'll think about it. Either way, I know I was going to put $5 from my spending money. That leaves me with $70 for spending this week, which is plenty. So this challenge is from is floating on cloud nine from Lisa Grateful Me. It was a freebie if you're subscribed to her channel. So if you are not, go ahead and subscribe to her channel. Um, I watch so many, so many of y'all videos. I I can't even tell you. I just love it. I just love it. That's what kind of got me out of my funk. But anyway, it now has five dollars. Look at this little cute. Oh my goodness, it's so cute. And we're gonna just go ahead and color in a five. Let's just do this one. I know I want this to go towards something. I just can't remember what. It'll come to me and I'll have to write it down. Because <laughs> like I said, my memory is just... I write it on here somewhere so that I remember. So yeah, that's the Floating on Cloud 9 challenge. I have now started. Uh... I hate the camera again, y'all. 
Yeah, this is probably not gonna work. Okay, lastly, we have our scratch off. And this is from Mel's Budget. And it's $250. If you are just now um, watching my channel, then you know that I scratch one off and I multiply them by four. One goes to debt, one goes to emergency fund, one goes to month ahead, and one goes to cushion. So let's just go ahead and scratch it off. I got to get some change from my wallet. And I'm going to really try not to shake the camera while I do this. But if it does, y'all just forgive me, okay? It happens. <clears throat> All right, so which one do we want to scratch off to? day i think i want to do let's do this one. Oh, actually let me stuff last week first so last week we did 17 i'm getting ahead of myself y'all so let's start here first i don't know if any of them is in this one i think so though so that means 17 goes to cushion and 17 goes to month ahead i think those two are in here yep so here's cushion cushion gets 17 and this is just me trying to get first 500 and then at least a thousand in my savings as a cushion for unexpected things it's getting the two dollars from my wallet and then it's getting 17 so 10 15, 16, 17. So let's just get it in here. So cushion now has 10, 20, 30, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49. So cushion now has 49. I think once it gets to 100, I'll put a placeholder in there and put it in my checking account, but we'll see. Um, the next one is month ahead, which I think is also in this one. Yep. And this is us trying to get a month ahead on our bills. And of course, we would like to be more than a month ahead, but that is for starters. So month ahead is getting the 17 as well. So 10... 15, 16, and 17. So month ahead now has 110, 20, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56. And I don't think that is enough to, I'm pretty sure it's not. Because I'm check off another month's bill, so, but I'll check it. Um, and then that's all for this one. The next two are in this short term and savings binder. So it is debt and emergency fund. So let's get to debt. And again, I was able to put that extra 30 whatever dollars I had into I mean, towards extra, towards my payment, I made my monthly minimum payment plus the extra 34, 38, whatever it was. I'll insert pictures of what my balance was before and after the payment. So they'll be like right here. Yeah, so you all see that I was able to make the extra payment. So now, this will just stack up until it's time to make the payment on that again because I'm focusing on one at a time. So, um, yeah. Once that's done, I think I'm going to go on to my cell phone and pay off my actual phone. The uh, installments, I think I have eight left. But I don't know. So, anyway, debt is getting the 17. So, 10, 15, 16, and 17 and then it's getting the zero out challenge as well which was 13 for the week one paycheck ended in seven one paycheck ended in six so debt so far extra debt payment now has 10 20 25 26 27 28 29 and 30 so that's already 30 and we got a whole month to go this one will probably be paid off in december thank god So that's extra debt. And the last one we are doing here is 
Um, oh, emergency fund. So I took those $100 placeholders out because obviously I used the money for the emergency that came, well, the unexpected thing that came up. This is now getting this 17, but I didn't want to be on her front and line, y'all. I want to be honest and real. And that $200 is no longer in the bank. So we're starting over. Emergency fund now has 10, 20, 25, 30, 31, 32, and 33. When we get to 100 again, I'll put a $100 placeholder in and put it in there. So that's it for the savings challenges let me do the scratch off this week and again i think i want to start a different one i think they are also from lisa gray for me the roll the dice i don't know but let's scratch off we'll still go ahead and do this one which is the one i wanted to do and i'm trying not to all right twenty dollars i think that's what that is Yep. So $20 is going into each four of those categories. So 20, we know times four is 80. So let me just get my pen. I wanted to show y'all my pen I got from work. It's so cute, but I keep forgetting to bring it whenever I. So we'll do times four, which we know is 80 bucks. So that's what we'll say for this one next time. I'll go back and write all those down. All right, so um, I think I may leave it at that. I don't know. Do I want to? start another one or not i really do need to start another one for my passport i need that done it's taking a long time now to get them back and i need it by april so i don't know guys i was gonna do roll the dice the one that's 168 because that is actually perfect let me just look at these. Y'all know I'm a geek for savings challenges. This is 125. Maybe I'll do this one. Mm. But this is the one where I know it'll be enough. Oh, I love this one too. I think I'm gonna do roll the dice. I don't know. Let's just see. I have dice here next to me. So, and that's the thing. I don't understand why they come with so many dice. <laughs> like, I, I don't know. I don't even have it open though. So maybe not. We'll see what we're looking at for next week. 80 and 57. Plus, I don't know. Let's just open it. And, like, do all dice have every... No, I guess not. Oh, see? I'm sorry. How do I know which ones I want to roll? Like, they all have different numbers on them, right? Or do, do every dice have every number? I, I don't know, y'all. I don't know. Let's just roll two. How about that? But I guess one, two... One, two, three, four... I don't know. I guess. I don't know. Yeah, I know I ain't no uh, <laughs> gambler or no gangster. Because I don't know nothing even about dice. So let's just roll them and see what we're going to put in here next week for my passport. $3. I'm going to roll again. But let me put a, a check mark um, by a 1 and a 2. So I can know what I did. Let me roll one more time. Now watch this something stupid big I ain't going to want to do. Okay, that ain't bad. A five and another one. That's good. So five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, I'll just put ten in there, I guess. <laughs> All right, guys, so that's it for the savings challenges this week. So thank you for watching my video. Let me know what savings challenges you are doing. Um, 
I have a few more I'm going to start after Christmas or for January, but I am excited. I'm excited. I'm excited. So again, thank you if you're already subscribed. If you're not, hit the subscribe button, like the video, leave me a comment, and I will see you all in the next one. Bye!